I have three poodles, okay? Jack, king ruler of all floof. Then we got Starlight, uh, hella good boy, gonna need a big bank, but we call him Buddy for short. Danforth, Lady Bird, Tiny, and we just call her whatever because she's really small and I don't think she knows her name. I do take my dogs everywhere with me. You see me on the street, I have one poodle in hand, usually the small one because she's kind of more like a little scarf. You really wouldn't even know she's there. Um, next. <laughs> There's a hierarchy of the dogs, okay? Jack, King, it's in the name, he's the alpha. You can't tell him anything. He's all power hungry, he knows you got the treats, so he's always on my good side. And if I give anyone any more attention, he just nudges his way in and he gets in there. And then um, Buddy is the one who, um, I, I, he consoles me, you know? He's the one who knows like when I'm, feel, when I'm feeling and is there to just cuddle. And then the little one, She's a diva. No, I'm just kidding, she's not a diva. But I do take her everywhere and all my friends really love her. I do talk to my dogs like they're humans. They are kind of my closest friends, they're my buddies. There are definitely things only my dogs know about me. Like, they somehow always know where my rogue socks are because they're always in their mouth. <laughs> my dogs are geniuses. They somehow always know where all my shoes are. Not in a good way. If I leave my shoes out, they're destroyed. They know that I take baths every night because they all sit with me while I take baths every night. They just stare at me and they wait for me to get out and sometimes they try to lick the bath water and I'm like, you need to go. You need to, no, it's not, it's not cute. My dogs do know my beauty routine and they know um, how many face masks I use and they also know how many stuffed animals I still have because they eat them as well. They try, I have them all above my bed and they always try and reach up and grab them but I'm like, no, no, your toys are on your bed. I have my toys and you have your toys. So we're still working that out, but they're babies, so they're still, they'll get there. They have to listen to a lot of Drake with me in the mornings, um, getting ready, blasting music, so they, they know, I don't think people know that, that I do <laughs> Oh, I do agility. I do <laughs> Is that interesting? No. So I do agility with one of my dogs, Jack, King Ruler of All Floof, and he's amazing at it. He is like an athlete. I, th I think he was born to do that. You know, I don't want to be a dog mom that like makes their kid get into agility, but I can't help it. My dog's a star. I actually tried to sign up for the uh, Beverly Hills Dog Show, but I missed the cut. I was going to bring Tiny out for her debut because she's perfect and she would have won everything. But um, I just didn't fit, it didn't fit my schedule this time. But next year I'm coming for you. Being a poodle person, it, um, it just happens to you, you either are or, or you aren't.